One of the way that's, ways that science works is it tries to make everything complicated and makes you believe that you need qualifications to understand stuff or you need millions of pounds to do research and whatever. But they make it over complicated so then you can't do anything and you depend on them to tell you and then you just repeat what you've been told. Something really simple. Have you ever got a ball? It'd be impossible to build buildings that tall in relation if that was the size of the earth. But what you could have is laser beams pointing up. Now the one that's straight in front of you, although it's leaning away from you, it will appear to be straight, like not leaning side to side while you're standing here. And then when you look at that one, it's leaning that way. You look at that one, it's leaning that way. So when something's straight in front of you on the earth, it'll appear to be straight up, as long as it's pointing straight up in relation to the ground. So then if you just stand on the spot and turn around, all of a sudden that one will be straight. That's how it works, isn't it? So without moving anywhere, all you've done is turn around. But now when you look back at that one that was straight, it's leaning over like that. When you look around to that one, look how far that one's leaning now. But then if you was to turn around while standing on the spot and you're looking straight ahead that one would now be upright because that's how it works on the earth isn't it and then you just turn your head that one's leaning that far that one's leaning all that far and you turn around so that you're standing in the middle again and now that one's straight and look those two are leaning Hmm, a bit strange that, isn't it? But all you'd have to do to make the entire reality of the earth change and to stop that from leaning is to just turn around on the spot and all of a sudden now that becomes upright and that one's leaning. Is that really how it works?